My name is Raelle Johnston. I'm a Master of Public Administration student in the Johnston Shyama Graduate School of Public Policy. For my Blueprint 2020 submission, I looked at a particular job in the federal public service and how that job could be made better in order to support the public service values of respect for democracy, professional excellence, and public service. And that job is access to information. The right of access to information uh, has been held to be a quasi-constitutional right by the Supreme Court of Canada. It is fundamental to a functioning and effective democracy and it's a key tool that facilitates citizen engagement in the public policy process. However, um, access to information coordinators find themselves in a difficult position. Their values, their positions are under-resourced and undervalued. Um, they've been called the meat and the sandwich, brokering access between the bureaucracy and the public. Um, there's several roadblocks to access to information at the federal level. There's direct political interference, um, there's a general culture of secrecy, and there's other more subtle techniques of opacity that are employed. I suggest that uh, public service reform under Blueprint 2020 can address the federal access to information regime um, in order to meet the principles in Blueprint 2020. Access to information change will include uh, legislative change and um, information and records management solutions and technological changes. But in my paper I suggest that there are three areas that public service reform can address to affect a change in culture. These areas are resources, professionalization and leadership. Uh, resources is pretty straightforward. There needs to be more staff and they need the tools and support to do their job. Professionalization. The job needs to be seen as a viable and professional career choice with opportunities for advancement. Public service reform can um, support this by providing appropriate training, tools and technology and implementing um, performance management and reward systems, as well as training the entire public service on the value of access to information. And the third is leadership. Quite simply, there needs to be buy-in from the leadership in the value of access to information. Um, so I suggest that uh, Blueprint 2020 and public service reform can address these three areas um, in order to support public service values.